Slightly later, still Tuesday the 30th, last day in September 2008 in Amble, Northumbria, England. Okay, it's 3 a.m. England time. Okay, and I just had a walk and stuff. I mean, it's not a game, this financial meltdown. These fucking little crooks have been at it for more than a decade, 15 years, since Mrs. Thatcher kicked in, actually. Okay, that's the 80s, so that's 30 years, isn't it? Ugh. Markets, 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 markets. Money, 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 money. Why can't they see what they're doing? <sighs> On the backs of the peasants. In India, for instance. I was out in India, okay, in the year 2005. Uh, a thousand million Indians. Um, 300 million are below the poverty line. The rupee was uh, one pound was 75 rupees when I went up in July, August, September uh, 2005. The poor people were going for like one pound a day, 65 rupees. Okay, they've got a peasant economy. Okay, 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 fine. But 300 million human beings in the caste system support 700 million, don't they? And the Indians love it. It's brilliant. It's brilliant for them that runs up higher. In England we had a system, okay? We had the high ups, the middle class, and the lower classes who supported the high ups. What's new? These high ups are crooks, okay? I'm a Christian. Now, utterly before God, we're all equal. You're born, you die, for heaven's sake. You're born, you die. Those are the two certainties in life. You're one is born, one dies. I'm blessed. I have come from a very good, normal, middle class family. Doctors, nurses, farming people, and one missionary who trained with Dr. David Livingston. William Ross. Okay, I've been out there in Kuruman, in uh, the desert, in the Kalahari in Africa. These fucking little wankers are assholes. They're assholes. They're complete, total, utter, filthy, fucking assholes. Creaming off the cream, yeah, but there's no cream left now all of a sudden. Ha ha ha. Ho ho ho. I'm still a Christian. No one can take that away from me. I had beautiful parents, grandparents, great, great, great grandmother was wonderful. Okay. <laughs> the children had to bow before her in the morning. If she didn't want to see them, go away. They're a bunch of fucking wankers, these politicians. Why can't they see it? They're so blinded by money and power and influence and stuff. They're a bunch of fucking assholes. Hmm. Hmm. I don't apologize for the language. I can't find strong enough language to speak about it. If I don't speak, then I just cry about it. I'm so sad. I can't find strong enough language, so that's why I use such strong words. But I mean, they're not, they're nothing, it's rubbish. Right. But evil people, try that one. Okay, Mr. George W. on the telly now is evil. Okay, he should be tried for crimes against humanity. As long as he sits on the telly, I will keep telling him he should be tried for crimes against humanity. He's an evil man. I'm a Christian. I love you, my Lord. 